7.40 right now. I tried to go to bed early last night so I can start waking up early moving forward. Usually what happens is that I wake up at 10, go for a run if it's an on day for runs, and then by the time I sit down to like get some work done, it's like already like the afternoon, like 12 or like one or something like that. So I feel like I'm losing out on a lot of time. So I'm trying to wake up earlier now. Um, today's day one. I'll keep you guys updated in future episodes of Life Docs to see how that goes. But um, I ran yesterday and recently I've been increasing my distance uh, on my run. So my knees have been taking a beating. So I think I'm going to take today off. Um, what I haven't been doing is like doing like body weight, like calisthenics workouts. So I think maybe today will also be a good day to start doing that on my off days that I don't run. So let's just do a quick little circuit, jump in the shower, and then hopefully we can start getting some work done. Uh, right around nine. Both of these bags have katsu in them, but this bag had a bigger slice and then this bag has smaller slices. And I don't want to eat two small slices. I don't want to eat two big slices, but I do want to eat two pieces. Slices? Have I really been saying slices? Oh God. Just finished up lunch and I'm just continuing to take a little bit of a break because all day my top priority is literally just to edit all the different videos that I'm working on right now not just videos for this channel but also videos for my portfolio and just a little bit of freelance work as well if I have time today then I'll probably try to hit um, some admin stuff that was the dryer. As I was saying, <laughs> if I have time, I'm gonna try to hit some admin uh, related task at the end of the today. But as you guys can see, like I'm gonna be staying home pretty much like the entire day today. And this is my reality for a very large majority of my days throughout the week. Um, I'm not working a job. I'm not in school <laughs> anymore. There's no class, there's no office to go to. And it does make things like pretty difficult. Um, I'm like literally like in this room, like pretty much like all the time. The only device that I have that's powerful enough to like do all like my video photo work is like my desktop too. So like a lot of times, like depending on my work, I can't take it like to a coffee shop just to get like a, a change of pace or anything. So yeah, it's hard, but I just wanted to give you guys an idea um, of what my reality is because a lot of times I think on social media and especially in season one of Life Docs, a lot of my vlogs were me like just like running around doing a bunch of stuff and also like being with my friends a lot. But now that I'm not in school anymore, this is just how things are right now. <laughs> Uh, 
Okay, hi. It's 10 p.m. I have to be a little bit quiet because my parents are trying to sleep right now. But the reason why I have not been filming for the past couple hours is because one of the books that I'm reading right now, Grit by Angela Duckworth, but the book started talking a lot about like life purpose, like what does like passion like really mean and stuff like that. And I feel like I'm low key having a quarter life crisis. <laughs> I guess this is what happens when you read self-help and self-development books. So that's why I haven't been filming. And I honestly don't know if I'm going to be filming more episodes of Life Talks for season two in the near future. <laughs> so I'm sorry, but I feel like now is the time to kind of think about a lot of these big questions when I'm done with school, I'm not working yet, and I have all this time to just kind of really reflect and like think about a lot of these things. Um, and I think the earlier that I can, you know, kind of ground myself in like a founding principle, then I think the better I'll be able to live my life and eliminate distractions. So, yeah. Pretty abrupt ending to this episode of Life Docs, but that's life, I guess. <laughs>